Sally and I told the lady what I wanted and everything that was like four months ago in December from last year 2017 we are on March and that was for my birthday so I originally started dyeing my hair um, with the L'Oreal Technique high color red for dark hair because my hair was brown and then on the tips it was blonde so I started dyeing my hair with uh, with the shade hot red. This is how it looked like, and if you can read right here. It says hot red. I don't know if this can focus. I dyed it this color until last month, and then my hair is still kind of reddish, but it's like brownish reddish, sort of. And I wanna go a shade lighter. So I went to Sally yesterday. Goes. And I picked up, I pick up some goodies. So I got this thing that is like really good for like two to three times that you shower, and it's for red hair. So it protects the intense. It, it repairs your hair. It won't let it um, fade that much on the first days that it still comes up. And then I pick up this one. So I'm really I didn't see no reviews for this but this one girl I didn't I didn't um look up reviews for this one at all so I just literally grabbed it and it doesn't show the color but it's like lighter way lighter so not that lighter but it is lighter so this one is the Mystic Divine Luminous Shine Permanent Liquid Cream Hair Color and it says the color is 51R and it's got intense red, intense red for light brown hair so it doesn't, I rip it off from the English part, this was in English and well now I can't read it so let's throw that Okay, so she said that this was for half of it, the collection. I don't know how to use this. Okay, so I guess I have to use everything. It says to use everything. It says to put 3 ounces and down here it says 3 ounces. I don't know if you can see that. Let me see. This is 3 ounces, so I guess I'm using everything. Uh, I'm really scared. Oh. Okay, so I'm just I'm really scared. Okay, so I have my little thing here again. So Look. Is that even red? Oh, shit, I got it. I'm sorry. It smells really strong. So this is how it looks. I don't know how much three ounces of product of the developer I need. So I have this big one. Oh yeah, I forgot. So this thing was like eight dollars, and then this thing was five dollars at Sally's. But this one I had it way before. I bought it for this. So yeah, I have the L'Oreal Technique um, Cream Volume 12. I mean 20. I don't know how much is three ounces, so I'm just gonna do whatever I think is best. So, it took me to use a number 30, but I don't have a 30, so I'm putting a look Hopefully, I don't go with I don't know how much three ounces are. Hopefully, my hair goes on. Yes. I don't care if I go there. So now it's looking kind of reddish, sort of. Apparently, it looks weird. So I'm just mixing it. I don't know 
Good thing my hair is not only yellow. If I burn my hair or something, when I go bold, it will go again. So I'm not scared. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my god, stop fucking lying. If you are thinking or you want to dye your hair red, just know that it's an investment because red fades quick. So you have to be dyeing your hair every fucking month. Once a month is when I dye my hair. Or every once in like once in a month and a half or so. But red fades a lot. First, you have to be patient, take care of your hair, don't strain it a lot. I, I don't strain my hair. You have to shower with cold water, wash your hair with cold water. Um, shampoos are expensive. The big shampoo is like $12 and then the little one is $9. Little shampoo is little and thin. Let me show you the big one. So this is the big shampoo. This was like $12, $15 each so i have the shampoo and the day that i went to pick this up there was not conditioner on this side so i had to buy the little one but i have this a small bottle for shampoo because i with this one this is the third time that i fill this one up so imagine how big is this one so imagine having to pay 15 times to 30 dollars for shampoo but if you ain't about that then why the fuck are you dying your red hair um second you have to buy new hair dyes every fucking month. So when I used to dye my hair like this one, this one six dollars each. So I will spend fifteen dollars a month in two of these, plus taxes and everything. It will be like fifteen dollars. But since I'm trying this one and it's really big, it was just like seven dollars. So yeah. Three weeks later. What I'm gonna do is that I'm just going to go for it and apply it. But before applying it, I'm going to divide my hair and just leave a little bit down. And before I start, I'm going to apply my, I mean, I'm going to put, yeah, apply this thing, uh, Vaselina, so my skin doesn't get like So I'm just going to grab a little bit and I'm just going to put it. So I don't get my hair, like my skin, and on the top of my ear, the back of my ear. You don't want to put a lot because then when it's take a shower, it's really hard to like take it off and stuff. So, yeah. So then I bite this into two parts.
I like this dye better than the other one that I used to dye my hair with. Okay, so like I was saying, this is the final result of my hair. This is how it looks in like the shade, I guess, um, in La Sombra. And I'm really in love with my new hair dye. Like, I really love my hair. It just... It's just the right color that I wanted to reach and I feel that it haven't fade as quick as the other one, the L'Oreal um, Technique one. And I really like this dye, like for real. And it doesn't smell that, it doesn't have that chemical smell that my hair will have if I would have dyed it with the um, L'Oreal Technique. Like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and don't forget to turn on your post notification, that little bell, so you can get notified whenever I upload a new video. See you next time, babies.